we will spend a little bit more time on the exit formula. Um, I really like this. I really like this mantra here. At Exit Realty, we believe in pointing our associates toward financial security by offering the opportunity to earn more than 100%. Follow their dreams, create a retirement plan, and leave a legacy. Okay, let's just look at it like this. You're on an 80-20 split at Exit Vanguard. If you, if you sponsor two, two agents or two associates that we convert into agents, we train them up, they become agents, and we get them to doing business, and you make 7 to 10% of the money that they bring in up to $100,000 a year, okay, you will be making more than 100%. Like a lot of people are going to complain or a lot of people have complained about 80-20 split. I can just go to the um, the 100% the, the commission people and, and I don't have to change my, I don't have to do my splits. Just bring in your two sons. Bring in your best friend and your, uh, your, your colleague who wants to get in real estate. We ramp those two up you'll be making your 100% and you'll consistently, you'll be making, when you need to take a break, when you have other things going on, you still have income coming in, okay? So it's about performance. I have a whole video series on 100% commissions on my uh, Kevin Roy Real Estate Pro channel. If you have questions about that, listen, it's not all bad, it's not all good. Nothing is. It's all about what fits you. Okay. So take a look at that at least. If you're in a decision maker process between what type of brokerage you want to be involved in, my suggestion would be this it's not about the overall split, it's about the relationship with the leadership of that brokerage. And it's about how you're going, how you're going to make money in that brokerage and how you want to make money in that brokerage. Okay, we discussed all of these benefits in a prior video. And I guess this would be one little example of how the money would flow. I think this is pretty good. Uh, example one, Agent Lee receives gross commission of $15,000 and deposits to a commission account. Agent Lee's share was 70%. And see, the standard is 70%, but I, I but I feel like 80-20, I'm willing to to uh, I'm willing to do more and risk more and invest more in agents in hopes that their performance and, and will increase my return on investment. So in this example, 70% which means Agent Lee would get $10,500 uh, minus the exit corporate fees. So ex on a transaction, exit corporate fees, let's look at this. Gross commission under $200, no fee. Gross commission $200 to $2,050. Gross commission $2,000 to $3,500, $150. Gross commission $3,500 and up $225. So, you know... If you're doing a um, a rental, you know, and you, and you make a thousand dollars, which would be, you know, half of fifty percent of the first month's rent in this area, um, you know, it would you'd have to pay fifty dollars to exit for the transaction fee. That's not ours. That's that's the corporate. And under two thousand, no fee for the regional development. There's a regional development fee that the regional owners would receive, and that helps with marketing. He they use that money to advertise on a regional level. Um, but if it's above 2,000, it's 35 bucks. So, you know, let's just say you max them out. You, this $10,000 transaction, it would be 225 plus 35, okay? So you'll see it here, yep, right here. 225 and then regional development fee 35 for a net check of 10,240. Um, now, the broker retains 20% of that, which would be, $3,000. And then uh, the, the other 10% is 
is the sponsorship. So whoever sponsored you in would get that other 1500. So in this situation, if I was a broker and I'm on an 80-20, I'm not going to be greedy and try to take the 10%, 20% plus the sponsorship. I'm just going to say 10% for overhead plus the sponsorship. So the broker in this situation would make $3,000 and the agent could add another 1500 on top of that 10200 uh, and 40. So, you know, that's another difference that Exit Vanguard makes um, in the marketplace. Uh, but again, I'm going to do my part. You'll need to do your part. If if you're not bringing in any money, zero from zero is zero. So what difference does it make whether it's 70 or 80 percent? So, again, let's make some money together. Sponsoring bonuses are paid electronically. So the way it works, you go to closing. Um, they don't typically give us checks anymore at closing. Um, we have to wait for the check a couple days from the uh, either from a wire from the title company or from or go to their title company, whoever's closing the transaction to get the check, deposit the check, notify exit of the transaction. They'll take the money out. Then they'll allocate the, month, the the funds via check to back into my account, and then I'll pay the agent. So you're still looking at about a seven day process um, from closing to when I cut the checks out uh, to my agents. You can come to the office, or we can deposit the checks right into your account. We don't mess around with people's money. Once we get it, we want to give it back out. 